MLS team of the season is here and with that we have got ourselves a team of the season moments Lorenzo Insigne objective today we're going to go over all of these objectives step by step giving you guys my tips and tricks and if necessary a squad builder if you guys do enjoy make sure to drop a like on the video subscribe for more FIFA 23 objective guides and some other stuff on the side we do the occasional play review and make sure to check me out over on Twitch let's get into it so first of all we have got Fidnes King which is score four for these goals using play players from Italy in squad battles on at least semi-pro once again we have got that option to do it in rivals or foot champs as well do want to clarify foot champs playoffs do class as foot champs which is amazing and um, now a finesse goal if you do not know how to score a finesse goal here is an example to score a finesse shot all you have to do is press down on the right bumper plus shoot so r1 plus circle if you are on playstation rb plus b if you are on xbox very self-explanatory obviously whilst pressing this you are going to want to aim in the direction you want to shoot the ball so you're just going to want to try get them with some italian players assist five goals using players with at least 80 pace pac massive 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 misconception lots of the times people saying does that mean passing what does minimum mean maybe if english isn't your first language um 93 pace aka for example i say 93 pace because that's the pace insigne has right so his 93 pace has to be 80 or above so 80 81 82 83 so on so forth once again you can do that in squad battles or rivals or champs score and assist using italian players in three separate games now this one here as well i do want to clarify you do not have to score and assist with the same italian player okay so you can assist with one italian player and score it with another italian player the first two Italians that come to mind, let's just say Chiesa. Let's say you assist with Chiesa and you score with Mobile. I'm just thinking of random Italians. But let's say you do that and it's one goal sequence, assist with Chiesa, score from that assist with Mobile. That will count as one. I mean, although it's only one goal sequence, you're scoring and assisting using Italian players, right? It does not have to be with the same player. Now, I've got win seven squad battle matches on at least semi-pro. Once again, all rivals and champs whilst having at least one MLS player in your starting 11, which is beautiful from EA. Usually, I mean, same as last weekend, they only made it one player um, from that specific league. I think we had Luis Gustavo last weekend, and they said you only needed one Saudi league player, which is beautiful. But I've done the same this week. You only need one MLS player. And two of these four objectives are based around Italians. We've got a score and assist using Italians, score four finesse goals using Italians. Then obviously you've got the assist goals with players with at least 80 pace, which I promise you'll just get this done naturally, assuming you've got players with at least 80 pace anyway. Um, so you genuinely just need to get some Italian attackers in your squad and an MLS player. As simple as that. And you could definitely get this one done in rivals or foot champs, whatever you want. But this is how my team is currently looking. We do not have any Italians right now. So what I'm going to do and what you guys should do as well is simply search your club for some Italian players. Now, I've got a Marquisio who will be brilliant for me to use. A Marquisio. I mean, a Jorginho even. Like, just have a, an Italian midfield. But you kind of want to be looking for some uh, attackers, don't you? Because you need to score and assist. So that would be a bit tricky with some attackers. So if you do... Sorry, with some midfielders. Now, if you guys do not have any great Italian attackers like myself, what I would recommend doing is simply getting the man himself, Insigne, the one whose objectives we are doing, because he will be two birds with one stone. He'll be the Italian that you can try score and assist with, and he will also be the Italian, uh, sorry, the MLS player that you need in your squad. I think you kind of need two Italian players to try and get this, not necessarily to work as well, but I think you need two Italian players to kind of help you out here and just get the Italian goal and assist. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use Insigne at left wing, and I'll just say use Chiesa as a cam. It doesn't matter that they're off chemistry, um, as long as they're in a relatively attacking position and then what i can do is obviously full in the rest of my squad i want to try and get a goal and assist you can link up with obviously chiesa and insigne get those goals and assist with italians score with players with at least 80 pace my full front three is at least 80 pace chiesa and insigne also players with 80 plus pace so they can help with them as well and then you have to score finesse goals with italian players which is going to be insigne or chiesa so after you get the goals and assist with chiesa which i would probably recommend doing in squad battles and as always when it does come to the squad battles tip it'll be a quick squad battles tip for today but essentially all it is and we've got some insane bronze to rewards, so we'll just skip past then but, but essentially all it is right is playing the worst team you get every single time we've got a 79 rated squad with only one chemistry here if we view this team 
it is going to be like awful. We can beat this team on semi-pro easily. So go ahead, put it on semi-pro, which is the lowest rated uh, required difficulty that you can play it on. And we'll be able to absolutely blitz them. You could get the Italian goal and assist for that game. Then we can play this one here, 67 rating with 10 chem. And after you've played them, the option is not there right now, but you will have the option to update your opponents. You can update your opponents and then you'll get a whole new selection, play the worst team and just keep doing that. So you could do that to get the Italian goals and assists or maybe the little bit of the trickier ones. And then after you've done that, you'll have no more use for Chiesa. So you can go back to your like main team. Obviously, I don't have a sentiment and left back in this team right now, but let's just pretend that these guys are fooled out. And we've just got Insigne starting on zero chem. And what you can do is simply go into a rivals or a foot champs game. And then with Insigne starting, pause it straight away and then sub him off for your usual player. So essentially going to be like using your main team for the final four games or like assuming you get the free, the free games, you're getting the Italian goals and assists, you'll be left with needing to get four wins with an MLS player. You start that MLS player, you sub him off straight away. It is as simple as that. So as always for the recap slash overview, the score for finesse goals using players from Italy. If you're using the example I did with Insigne or Chiesa, maybe you've got some other Italian players assisting five goals with players with at least 80 pace it is assisting sorry i think i said scoring earlier but it's assisting the goals which is easy enough score and assist using italians obviously you want to try to get two italians and you can try to get it done in a goal sequence assisting that one, one italian and then scoring that from that assist with the other italian you have to do that in three separate games and then you have to win seven matches with at least one mls player i reckon you play three squad battle games playing the worst one within those three ones try to get a goal and an assist with italian in each of those three games whilst in the process getting the five assist with players of at least 80 pace and scoring those four finesse goals that will leave you with four wins to get um, and you can do that in rivals or foot champs you just need at least one MLS player in your starting squad you can go into the game with them in your starting squad pause it straight away sub him off and it will just be like an ordinary four rivals or foot champs games as easy as that ladies and gentlemen happy grinding and until the next one see you boys later